This is Snap and Specs mobile application for Android. Here you can see the dash. You can view a list of inspections for the day. You can view your entire portfolio. You can add a new property on the go. And you can sync to the web application. So we'll start with inspections. You'll see a simple list of properties to inspect for the day. They're ordered shows you the time that you've scheduled them, you can see the address, and you can also view for days in advance or previous days. Now you can also view the same list of properties, bird's eye view, on a GPS map. So you can get a, you can get a, a bird's eye view of where you're going to be going for the day. The next one is properties. You can view your entire portfolio you can search by street name, you can search by the tenant's name or the owner's name and it will pull up any property you're interested in. So we'll look at this one here. So it will show you the address, the tenants, the owners, the key and alarm info, if you want to put that in. You can also view it on a map and get GPS directions to it. And you can also view the inspection details like when it's scheduled for inspection, when it's due for inspection, and the last time the property was inspected. So we'll go ahead and we'll, we'll do a test inspection on this property. So you've got the option between ingoing, routine, or exit. I'm going to do an ingoing. Now because I haven't inspected this property before, it's going to ask me for the layout. So this property has one entrance, one lounge, one dining room, one kitchen, two bedrooms, one toilet, and I'm going to go ahead and mark the rest as zero, just to make it simple. Next. Now you only have to set the property layout for each property once. The next time I go to inspect this property, it's going to automatically remember it. And it's done. Now I can see a list of all the different rooms to be inspected today. So I'm going to start with the lounge. Now because there are... Uh, because you can have multiple lounges or multiple bedrooms, the next time you go to inspect the property, you are not going to be able to tell the difference between lounge 1 and lounge 2. So that's why we created room ID photos. So that the next time you come to inspect the property, you can see a photo of the room and tell the difference between room 1 and room 2. So that that photo is going to be there next time I come to inspect the property. Now, you go through the criteria, such as doors and locks, and you mark them off as clean, undamaged, and working. You can either mark them yes or no, or leave them blank. And you can also write comments. So I'm just going to go ahead and mark these criteria off. Now, if this criteria doesn't fit the particular room, you can add additional criteria or you can delete different criteria so you can customize it 100% and you can also take photos so you can take inspection photos for the property these photos aren't very good because I'm just using this on my desk so once you've gone and you've taken some photos and you've marked off the criteria you mark this bedroom lounge as all done. Are you sure you have are you sure you have finished inspecting this room? Yes. And it will tick it off ready to move on to the next room. So you go through all the different rooms, you inspect them, take photos, mark off the criteria. You can always add an additional room if you forgot it in the layout. And once you're done with that, you mark the property as all done. Are you sure you've finished inspecting 121 Paratai? Yes. And you'll see it ticked off on your inspection schedule for the day, ready to move on to the next property. You can also search your portfolio for anything, whether you're in the office or on the road. And when you're done for the day, and you need to sync everything over to your computer, you just hit the sync button. It says, are you sure you want to sync? 
Uh, we recommend using Wi-Fi because sometimes if you take a lot of photos it may, may be a large file. Um, but you can sync on 3G too, and heaps of our property managers do sync on 3G. They don't have a problem with it. So I'm just going to go ahead and mark yes, and it's going to sync over to the computer. Then when I log in from the computer, I'll be able to pull up the reports in either PDF or Microsoft Word form and send them directly to the property owners. The reports have my own branding on them, they're 100% customizable and they can comply with all the different states. So we've got reports for whatever you need. So that's a quick overview of Snap and Specs mobile application for Android. Go to www.snapinspect.com and request a free trial so that you can have a go with Snap Inspect yourself and see if it saves you hours of time. Thanks for watching.